shit! you always do. Hey, you! Listen, can you give me a ride? My wife's gone crazy. I'll throw some dollars your way. Yeah, I would if I had a vehicle to give you a ride in. Let me see what I can do. Okay, I'll wait here and take a good long look at my life, strewn all over the front yard. Thanks, man. Just let me grab my favorite iron. Just not getting that. What a mess. A really great wardrobe out for all to see. Whatever. I can't deal with it right now. Can you drop me off at the golf club in Richmond? At least I know I'll be welcome there. So, you're just gonna leave all your stuff in the driveway? Yeah, I'm not giving her the satisfaction of cleaning that up. I'll go to the club, get a few drinks in me, and hope either her meds have kicked in or the gin is worn off by the time I get back. I appreciate you doing this, by the way. I, I know it's kind of a weird one. What's your name? Michael. Good to meet you. I'm Castro. What is that, Italian? You have got to be kidding me. I'm good like that. I don't want to embarrass her. Then she goes and literally airs our dirty laundry in front of all the neighbors. If you just drop me off at the entrance here, that'd be great. Thanks again. Hey, we should play golf sometime. Come by the club. I'm here most days. Davy, how you doing? About as good as can be expected. But the news is not good. I don't know what you're talking about. I know you did that fucking jewelry job. Davy, seriously, you're imagining things. Fuck you. All right. I did it. Arrest me. You know what? You'll be saving my life. Because you called it, motherfucker. What? You called it. Trevor. A couple days ago. But we haven't really talked about anything either. But if, no, when, he starts asking questions about why you're not feeding worms south of the Canadian border. Oh, we got problems. Yeah, no shit. <sighs> We're in it. Together. So, and we better go about saving it together, because you and I both know we can't let it go to shit now. What do you need? This guy, Ferdinand Karamov. The agency claims he's dead. We at the Bureau think they're full of crap. We think he's being debriefed someplace. So? Apparently, he has information which will put me and my superiors out of circulation. Those agency fuckers have got the coroner's office locked down. We need you to verify the body. So how the hell am I gonna get in here? No, well, you've played dead before, haven't you? I have always kind of liked you. 
Call me when you wake up. I'll tell you what to do. What we got? Uh, John Doe, white male, overweight, in his late 40s, possible coroner. Let's take a peek. The fat deposits on his hips and abdomen suggest a fondness for bleeder burgers. We're probably about to find one in his gut, still in its wrapper. What the hell was that? Don't worry, it's just... Ah! Oh, Jesus! Ah! Back from the dead, ah! motherfucker! Ah! 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 Come out! Hands in the air! Come on. Might be in the other room. You want to end up on the slab? Out of there! That don't look right. Guess you can't judge a corpse by its toe tail. Aye, aye, aye! Hey, stop! Put your hands on your head! Jack off! Metro, we have an agent death! <laughs> Should have stayed on the slab. We're on lockdown. This is fuck. Don't 
Don't push me! Hey, I already died once today! Holy fucking Christ! for the greater good. those oil derricks just outside town, El Burrow Heights. And make sure you're not tailed. Man, that don't sound too good, homie. Look, I'm on my way. Dave, the hell was that? You know how many spooks I just ran into? I'm sorry. They're not nice people if that's a consolation. What's going on? There's a big target out there, something in the shadows. The data algorithms are reading off the charts. Whoever finds it, the Bureau or the agency, is gonna get up. Hey, Franklin. What's going on? You gotta get out of town. Man, I ain't exactly got nowhere to go. Well, then take a trip, a long trip. What the fuck is going on? Things, all right? Look, you remember. <laughs> 